Hellions, good afternoon. What? What? What do you have? What? Oh my god. Period Halloween, and guess what? 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 Guess what they had. Oh my god. Oh, shut the front door. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, let's see, let's see, let's see it. Oh my god. <laughs> Squirrel! That is so cool. Here, put it up I next to your face. To. You're the one that found it. Now smile, or eat it. Bite his head off. Ah! That is so cute. I had to. Oh, man. I had a coupon, too. We can't play with What's it, this? though. I think it squirts it's, water. It's ages 14 and up only. See? How old are you? Look, I, I'm not 14 <laughs> yet. And I got skull socks. Ooh, nice. Here. Right. That's for you. For my toolbox? <laughs> no, it's to go home. We're going to put it in the garden. Oh, Montserrat. Oh, how I love you. Oh, mwah, mwah, mwah. Hi. Look, Mommy got a squirrel. Uh, he was uh, not happy. Really? I'm sorry to say. Happy. He was not happy. <laughs> say not happy? I accidentally, I cut the camera off just before Lori Lee said that. And I'll let you say it again. What happened to him in spirit? He was scared. Oh no. Of the animatronics. Oh jeez. We must desensitize right away. Yes. I, I was walking him up to it and I was clicking the button and letting him go off and there was just two of them that really scared him. Uh-huh. Um, oh no. It was some weird zombie dude in the back that was holding a head that freaked him out and um, this pumpkin, this big pumpkin guy, corn stalker. It's All the more reason Lori Lee needs to carry a camera with her during the day. Gosh dang it, I'm so upset at myself. I stopped at Walgreens and Am I like dark? I always do this. I always like sit outside the vehicle and you can never see my face. I just have this huge silhouette, which probably is a good thing. Anyway, I went to Walgreens and they do have out their Halloween stuff. So pumped about it. And I'm about ready to go to Albertsons and just, while well, I'm getting food. Imagine that, going to a supermarket to get food. Crazy, right? Oh, they got pumpkins. No day would be complete without doing some kind of chore, of course, because we live in everyday society. Um, and we are all, I'm not gonna say the N word, I was gonna say the N-O-R-M-A-L word, but we're not. Trash. We have a lot of it because I'm trying to get rid of stuff that I've like, can't scrap, but came from stuff that I was scrapping. So, and that stuff has to be gone by Halloween, obviously, because this path has to be clear. So I'm like, jumping inside the trash can. That's my whole point in saying all this is, yeah, I jump in my trash can. How many of you guys do it? Post it down in the comments. <laughs> I do have to be careful because there's glass in here. Got more room than I thought, yay. So yesterday at the fair, we had poop in the vlog. Today we have trash. We're going downhill, guys. We're going downhill fast. Are you talking trash again? Yeah, I'm talking a lot of trash. It's funny, when he starts to yell now, he's been um, he's been uh, uh, shaking. Have you noticed that? Shaking? Yeah. He'll be like, ah! 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 <sighs> Uh, uh, no, uh, no, 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 don't do it. Quit. Like, it. No, don't, don't throw him. Oh, good boy, you set him down. <laughs> Every baby loves bubbles. Oh, look, it's a cluster F of bubbles. Bubble, Get the bubbles. Step on them. How dare you be soapy? Are you talking to him? <laughs> I'm so upset that I did not have this rolling. This was the cutest baby moment ever. He came over here and he picked the flower off of one of the plants and we've been telling him no. 
and I didn't notice him do it, but he starts walking towards me with this purple flower in his hand, and I'm like, oh, no. So he went, and he delicately, gently, put it back. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, you don't play with the plants. All right, guys. It's sold. <laughs> So what that means is is that Troy has approximately 20 hours that need to be dedicated to this, not during my work day, which is kind of needs to happen. Um, so I don't, I I haven't even finished the, oh, this is still on. I haven't even finished the interview uh, with Naomi Grossman yet, which I still need to get on. So I hope you guys uh, understand and you kind of still come along with me. The haunt's not canceled or anything. I'm just saying that. Every day is not going to be a build day, and I was really hoping it would be, and it kind of needs to be. What? I made some lasagna. Lasagna? Lasagna. Oh, okay. I eat lasagna. Uh, anyway, so that's what I want to say. However, just for ambiance, I think I'm going to take the orange lights, and I'm going to put them up around the perimeter out here, just because it would be really cool. Before I get started on my boring stuff, um, I will tell you that I have made up my mind about what is going to happen here out in the carport this year. Uh, first of all, uh, last year it was used as the queue line. And we just had like everybody like corralled in here. Uh, but this year what I'm going to do from probably the center pole right up here, the center pole. So that spot over to this wall here and probably one, two, three, four panels, maybe five panels long. Uh, a place for makeup and stuff like that because our house is so small it gets really really crowded inside and people are you know in the kitchen in the bathroom doing this stuff and we want our makeup artists to be able to work without being like really disturbed so uh, this also help uh, with like messes and stuff like that if you spill something on the ground eh, no big deal so I'll do like a couple like cheap little tables or whatever in there so that way they will be corralled in there nobody will be able to see them over here in the queue line but there will still be enough room over here uh, for people to walk down here and gather here before uh, we send them off into the graveyard up front. So there you go. A little bit of Halloween today. A little bit of, I don't know what kind of thumbnail I'm going to use today. The sooner I work on it, the sooner it gets done. The sooner it gets done, the sooner I can do other things. Yes. That's Phoenix and JD screwing around. They're having fun inside and I'm having my own kind of fun outside. Getting there, starting to get torn. It, it, wow, that was totally like redneck right there. Starting doesn't get ten torn apart. No man, damn. <laughs> oh my god, I love that so much. I totally had to move this light. I was getting like a sunburn. Can you get a sunburn from these freaking halogen lights? So anyway, there you go. Blah blah blah. There's my progress. All the bolts to the intake are like loose or actually most of them are off but uh anyway yeah done for the night um i figured since the vlog's gonna be short today why not do like uh a good coc so i'll do that here in a second i gotta catch my breath <laughs> hey guys it's time for cock um that's my little guy that i got yesterday at the fair and he is now my my editing buddy He's keeping an eye on me while I'm editing to make sure I don't freaking fall asleep. Which has happened before on more than one occasion and a lot recently. So, with that being said, cock from the night before. Barb Jaws 63 uh, you uh, gave us your concerns about Phoenix and the treadmill. Totally agree with you. There is actually a point to where Lori Lee got on the treadmill and I was holding Phoenix. And he was just like wanting to, to get next to his mom and everything. So, just as like precaution I put him in his playpen and that's where he's going to be when she's on it too so I totally understand that so yeah if you guys have a treadmill be careful with the young ones because you never they're so curious and getting something caught in there ugh, horrible magic unlimited are you making up the layout as you go no man it's all up here man it's all up there Jordan Winton are you still planning on the live video feed I don't know at this point uh, it kind of, it didn't bomb last year. It was cool for those, you know, dedicated people that, you know, wanted to see some of the scares. But as far, I, I don't know. I, I just don't know at this point. 
Judd Ware, you should get one of your local pizza places to sponsor you guys. Maybe have flyers on their pizza boxes. That's a good idea. I'll ask this pizza place up the street. It's a small mom and pop shop, so I'm not sure they would, but can't hurt to ask, right? And Naw Dog at 912, the Blair Phoenix Project. That made me laugh. It is off to cock number two from last night. Not the night before, but last night. Columbia Manor Haunted House. This is Corey, guys. He's one of our friends that we met down the West Coast. Uh, fellow haunter and I was wearing his shirt uh, yesterday at the fair so shout out to him and he said that he loves the shirt well of course <laughs> so it's nice to hear from you Corey underworld haunted house <laughs> that last part scared me I was looking so close at the screen that's funny I'm glad that you told me that because that's really freaking awesome um, and also uh, where did we get our banner at this was given to us by a subscriber a long time ago there that's where you go that's where the banner is made, and it's kind of made out of plastic, so you can use it at the haunt, in like all different kinds of weather. You would almost think that was like a paid advertisement. <laughs> Very useless words. That ghost pirate ride looks the same one, or looks like the same one that was at our fair. It probably is. Uh, the Piala Fair, just like a lot of places, uh, we use a company called Funtastic, and they are mobile and they take all their rides like all over the place. Borg X2679. That place looks like fun. Caption for the cow. Get that camera off me. Uh, um, I love the outro. I'm glad that you used my idea for breaking the glass, Troy. I like the skull with the dragon on it. Um, I'm glad that I used that idea, too. Thank you very much for suggesting suggesting that. That was very awesome. Park has said that Munster's Mansion is amazing. I had to laugh because in what I think was Marilyn's room, there was a poster of the monkeys on the wall. I think it may be the Beatles, too. Yes, <laughs> there was. Uh, well, at least the monkeys. I'm not sure if the Beatles were there or not. 13 UHF, thank you for adding us to your playlist. That's really awesome. Emerald Gypsy Heart, ooh, my ex was at the fair. Jack, oh, jackass. Okay, I get it now. I totally did not get that. I'm like, oh, did you see him in our video or something? And okay. No. Branson Haunted Hills reiterated the fact about uh, getting somebody, like a food shop, to sponsor the haunt. Vladimir Putin, will your cousin or I think brother be helping you with a haunt this year? Uh, Keith, no, actually, he's moving away. Uh, he's having his going away party this Sunday. So there you go, guys. Happy hauntings. See you tomorrow. Happy hauntings from the Bloodshed Manor.